Hi! Today, I will finally show you my skincare routine. I know many of you guys were waiting for my skincare routine video, but somehow I always had something else to film, <laughs> so I didn't get around to do that. And I also thought all of you know my skincare product collection. So I was thinking if I really need to do extra skincare video because I always have just one product per category. So it's somehow uh, clear what I'm using for my skincare. And another thing which I was quite scared about was that um, sitting in front of camera without any makeup. I love to do makeup because first it's a great fun for me, the procedure of doing makeup. And also I really like how I look like uh, after I put on makeup. So basically I hardly go out of the house without makeup. Although I don't wear very heavy makeup and people don't really notice that I'm wearing makeup at all. <laughs> But um, I know the difference with or without makeup and I really prefer to show uh, my face with makeup. So finally I got brave and decided to sit in front of the camera without any makeup. <laughs> so let's start. I washed my face with Clarang's Soothing Gentle Foaming Cleanser in the shower. Although this cleanser was not the first choice for me, just I'm using this because I didn't like the other two. But um, meanwhile, I really like this. It's actually for very dry or sensitive skin, but I think it cleanses enough. I don't get any skin impurity or pimple after I use this. So when this mild one um, works enough, then why should we go for stronger one? So um, if you want to try Clarang's uh, foaming cleanser, I really uh, recommend you to start with this product before you try the other ones. Then the next step is toning lotion. This is also from Clarang's hydrating toning lotion. This one is for normal to dry skin and I actually have combination skin but I had skin trouble uh, from the toning lotion which was designated for combination skin. So I had to take this and um, it works fine. So I'm just staying with this. So I put this out on the cotton pad. I put it out two times and very gently I wipe my skin. Here I didn't fix my hair backwards because I just took shower and my hair was still wet. I have to lift my fringe sometimes, but it's manageable. And also the neck. After the toner, it's time for serum. In the morning, I use Idra Essential Biface Serum. This one you have to shake before you use. One time I said I used just one pump because it was enough, but um, nowadays I'm again using one and a half or two pumps because I thought one pump is too less. But the pump of this bottle was faulty, so I had to press more times. So first I spread it all over my palms and then I applied on the face. This method was recommended by Clarangs. In the very beginning when I started to use Clarangs, I was thinking this method is quite wasteful because quite an amount is landing on my palm. Yet I couldn't find any other method. <laughs> that I can apply those um, skin product gently on my face. So I just um, accepted 
that method and I'm doing this now for the last 20 years. <laughs> and this serum is really great for hydrating your skin. And if you have got some fine lines due to dehydration, then this one will um, work immediately. Afterwards, I apply eye serum. This one is Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Eye Supercharged Complex. This one is actually an eye cream, but um, I use it as a serum because um, I used former version of this as a serum. That one was really a serum. And I don't find any big difference with this one and the former version. So I'm just continuing using this as a serum. I spoke about the story in my eye cream video. So I pick out a very little amount and spread it between my two index fingers and apply very carefully around my eyes. I apply uh, really everywhere around my eyes and especially the end of eye I apply very carefully because there I'm often getting fine lines. Then I apply moisturizer. This one is Clarang's Extra Farming Day Cream. This is for all skin types. They also have uh, another version for dry skin. Um, this one is actually for women in their 40s. Uh, because now I'm 50, <laughs> I should actually uh, change to the next one, which is made for uh, women in 50s. But uh, somehow this one works uh, fine. I really like it and I don't see any reason to change to the next one, more expensive one. I actually never tried them. Um, maybe in near future I will have a chance to try them or see. Then I apply eye cream. This one is also from Estee Lauder. So basically all my eye care products are from Estee Lauder. This one is called Resilience Multi-Effect Tripeptide Eye Cream. I'm using this for quite a long time, uh, as I mentioned in my eye cream video, and I'm very happy about this. This one is a little bit uh, firmer consistency, but as I have already eye serum underneath, so it's not difficult to spread. So same as eye serum, I first put it to my index finger and uh, spread it between two fingers and then apply again very carefully on my eyes. Then I apply lip balm. This one is actually lip oil from Clarence. I already made a video about that. At the moment during the day I really uh, love to wear Pitaya shade because it gives some nice pink color that I don't even need any lipstick. It's just difficult to open when I have skincare products on my finger, but <laughs> yeah, I can live with that. So basically I'm now just wearing this Pitaya lip oil, uh, although I applied uh, two layers to deepen the color. And I think the color is deep enough for your daily life. And finally, I apply sun cream. This one is Clarence UV Plus Anti-Pollution Moisturizing Sunscreen. Uh, this one is uh, translucent without any color. Uh, I used to love a former version of this, which was quite runny. I needed certain time to get used to this thicker consistency, but actually I like it now. Um, as it says, it's moisturizing because uh, they didn't say for this form version. I think it's not bad to have additional moisturizing layer. Now my skin is nicely prepared for the day. So after that, as you guys can see, I did makeup 
and also dried my hair, didn't curl today. <laughs> then let's have a look at the nighttime skincare routine. I had a concert on that day, so I was wearing full makeup, which means including liquid eyeliner. I somehow set up my lighting with two stands, so it's not that great, but hopefully you guys can see enough. So first I fix my hair together and also hair band. Then I got changed. So now I have to remove my makeup. The first thing I do is removing eye makeup with Clarang's Instant Eye Makeup Remover. This one is actually for waterproof or heavy makeup, but I always use this because this is um, still quite gentle. And with this one, you can um, remove effortlessly your eye makeup. So uh, this one is also two phases. You first have to shake it. And I pick out a little bit on my cotton pad and wipe my eyes very gently. They actually recommend to use different cotton pad for each eye, but I somehow manage with just one pad. Maybe because I don't wear very heavy eye makeup. <laughs> also lower lid and eyebrow i also roughly wipe away i do always double cleansing as long as i'm wearing makeup so first step is um, oil cleansing i use clarang's total cleansing oil i just uh, put out one pump on my palm and massage onto my face then i go to the bathroom and wash it off as soon as it has contact with water, then it's turned into some kind of milk and you can easily wash it off. Here I'm also removing tubing mascara and polymer eyeliner. After rinsing it off, I wash my face with foaming cleanser, which I also used in the morning. It doesn't lather much, but it's okay for me. And about every second day, so three or four times a week, I wash my face again with one step gentle exfoliating cleanser, which I really love. I try to massage mainly the T-zone and afterwards your skin feels like renewed. After washing my face, I come back to my dressing table and there I always have one separate towel just for my face. With that I tap very lightly just to absorb excess water. And the step is then quite similar to the morning step. First, toning lotion. But uh, I use different serum in the evening. I use Clarang's double serum. If you see the lid, you can choose those with small amount or larger amount. I always choose the larger amount and use one pump. That's exactly the amount I need. And again, spread on my palm and apply everywhere, my face and neck. Then again, eye serum. This is same one as in the morning. And night cream, also from the same series as day cream, Clarang's Extra Farming Night Cream. This one is also for all skin types. Then eye cream, same as in the morning. And as a lip balm, I again apply Clarang's Lip Comfort Oil. In the morning, I applied Pitaya for the day, but 
um, in the night, I apply the shade Honey because this one is really for nourishing and moisturizing your lips. Um, I explained about this in my lip oil video. This one is a sample size, but after that I will purchase the full sized one. Uh, one thing I do in the night that I don't do in the morning is applying Lotus face oil on my nose which I always have in sample size because I use just one drop per day. So I get one small drop on my fingertip and apply on my nose where I have larger pores, also a little bit nearby nose as well. And they recommend to use this mixed with toning lotion, but um, I just um, use the cotton pad which I just use to apply toning lotion which means it's still wet and with inside uh, so different side then which I applied my toning lotion I just tap my nose uh, softly that is somehow then mixed so that was it my skincare routine actually not very complicated <laughs> rather simple so hopefully this was helpful for you guys and if you have got any questions just feel free to ask in the comments. Thanks a lot for watching. I will see you in my next one. Bye!